your time! I'm feeling fine so far! Amber! Hey, you all right? Yes, I'm fine. I think that we should stop for today. You know what? Just go on. Go back to the rescue center, guys. I'd like to stay and practice. Okay. Wow, she wants to make this climb. <laughs> Amber, stay safe. Thanks, I will. <sighs> oh, when will I manage to climb this cliff to the top? Huh? And then I noticed how withered and sick this tree looks. You are so right. These trees don't look good at all. Hey, guys, huh? I found a strange bug. Look there. What kind of bug is it? I'm not sure, but this tree has the same problem as the other one. Do you think this bug has something to do with whatever's going on? It's possible it might. We should take it back to the rescue center and investigate. Sounds good. <laughs> Helly, will you look around and see if there are any other trees with the same symptoms? I will. file. All right. Huh. This is a harmful tree insect? All the trees in the village are sick because of that. I think somewhere in the owl forest is where it came from. It'd be great if you could investigate the area. I will. We're clear here. This side's fine as well. Huh? I found the infected trees. Amber! How goes the investigation? I just found a group of infected trees here in the forest. I'll send you the location. But I'd like to do a little more investigating first. Whoa! Whoa! What happened, Amber? Well, while I was checking the forest, I fell down here. My transmitter got broken, so there was no way of contacting you about the urgent situation I found. Urgent situation? Look! I found where all the insects are coming from. Oh, oh my. This is a big problem. But are you sure you're all right? Yes, I'm all right. But we don't have very much time. In order to save the woods, all of us have to work to stop the insects from spreading. Will you all help me? Yeah, got it. So what's your plan of action, Amber? Uh, uh, hmm. Yeah, Jin, we all just finished up here. I'll give you a full report when we get back, OK? Well, nice work today, everybody. Thanks. Thanks. Well, Polly and I can help Amber make her way to the top. Thanks, Roy. I'm fine. I can do it myself. Amber, you should accept their help. Your hand is hurt. My hand's fine. I want to do this myself. Okay. okay. All right. Time to climb. We'll be right here. Yes, you can make it to the top. Thanks. I'll try. My time. Ugh. The grappling hook is securely lodged. Good, Good luck. luck. Thanks. Phew! I made it! 
Yeah, yeah Amber. Amber! Wow, Titan, you're an enormous truck! I huh. thought Terry was the biggest truck mm -hmm. in town, but I think Titan huh? is actually even bigger! <laughs> you think I'm really large? Bruner, Terry just isn't pulling his normal giant trailer today, that's all. If he were, he'd be bigger. Indeed. What are you talking huh? about? It's obvious Titan's much bigger, right, Mr. Builder? Hmm, well, they look pretty much huh? the same. Huh? Let's all stop mm. this pointless huh? jabbering and get back to work, all yes. right? Yes! Fine. Titan, come on, friend. Let's go show them all how big you are. I really don't have time for these childish games. Then you're okay <sighs> with everybody thinking Terry's much bigger than you are? Oh. Well, I don't like hearing that at all. What? What on earth would Titan want to compare size with me for? Does it even make any sense to compare you to Titan? The whole thing just sounds sort of weird. Isn't there a better use of their time? Does it really matter if Terry's huh? bigger than you? It's obvious Titan's much bigger. Well, that really wasn't very nice. All right, let's go and check out how big you are so they won't compare you with Titan anymore. All right, but I'm wearing a container. Let them see what an actual piece of heavy machinery looks like. Right on! Go get them, Terry! And are you ready for this? Well, they have actually been saying that I'm the smallest one in the entire town. But it's clear that Posty is quite a bit smaller than I am. I mean, it's hard not to take this stuff huh. personally, right? Is it me? Or isn't this a matter of pride in yourself as a vehicle and our pride as workers at the harbor? We'll be all right. Everybody's waiting. Let's hurry up. Huh? Uh, Lifty, hold on. What's up? My trailer. I think it's stuck. What? Well, there's something you can do about it, right? Something like crouch down? It wouldn't work. I forgot that I'm not supposed to pass under here with a container on. You're not? Oh. allow us to unhook the container and pull the whole thing out of there. You're right. Then we just have to put the air back in and Terry drives out. Sounds like a great plan. Then Amber and Helen, you take the air out of the tires while Roy and I move the container. Okay. okay. Oh. Done, Polly! Right, now let's move the container out. Okay. All right. Huh. Lift! Huh. Uh. Uh. Now to refill the tires. Uh. Thanks so much! Yeah! All right! Terry's out! <laughs> <laughs> well, are you both ready? Yes! Huh? Um, your height is almost the same. 
same. Right, huh? just an acorn size apart. The size of an acorn? <laughs> <laughs> What's this? Oh, that. That's the good conduct medal that I was awarded when I was young. A good conduct medal? That means you served your country, right? That's right. That's really yeah. incredible. Wow, it must be great to have a medal. Can I take a closer look at it, please? Sure you can. Wow, this is the coolest thing. <laughs> <Whoa. laughs> well, I guess I'll go start cleaning up my office now. Ms. Bell, wait! May I have the honor of helping you out with your office cleanup? Sure you can. Do you think you could start with the file cabinet? Yay! Oh, careful, Lifty! Uh, nothing like a perfect pour. Mickey! Huh? Mickey, you haven't seen my medal, have you? Sorry, Ms. Bell. No metal here. Oh, well now what? It's not like I can go out and replace it. Well, if it's not here, do you think someone took it? But who would do something like that? Unless... It's the coolest thing. Lifty, have you really not seen my medal? Not since yesterday. Wait, you don't think I took it, do you? Well, I know it was in one of the boxes you moved. But, Miss Bell... I would never take something that belonged to you without asking you first. What kind of friend do you think I am? I would never do that. <laughs> Lifty. Oh. Hmm. Mom. What if I dropped the metal out of the box by accident? Ah, then it is my fault. What do I do now? Oh, where is it? Where can it be? It's not here. I don't see it anywhere. Huh? Hmm, could that be it? <laughs> oh, this isn't even close. Come on, Lucky. Hurry up. Huh? Oh, put it down! Put it down! What, what did, did you, you just say? say? It's me, Lefty! Huh? Please put the pipe down! <gasps> Uh, what do I do? What do you think? Just put him down! Right! The uh, other way! Uh, I can't control myself! Something's wrong! My gears are still stuck! Check it out! Okay! Do you have to pull out of the pipe? Hold it steady, Lucky. But that's what I'm trying to do! Guys! Hurry! Uh, 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 it's okay, Lifty! Help is coming! Okay. Uh, hold on! I'm working on it. Uh, Roy, put the ladder up. All right. All set. Lefty, come on out. Going down. <laughs> yeah. Good job. Nice work, Lefty. Precious metal huh? detected. Hooray! Metal we found detected. it! 
Here you go! Huh? My medal! Lifty, it was here all along! <laughs> I saw <so> relieved! <laughs> <laughs> Scooby? Oh. oh, oh, hi, Polly. Scooby, you shouldn't be napping under the hot sun today. Mr. Wheeler passed out yesterday while he was working. It's dangerous. Oh, why was that? Because of the sun? That's right. So please go directly home after school is out, all right? Oh, well, I, um... Scooby, you promised that we'd play together after <laughs> school today, remember? Yeah. <laughs> Yay, we're, we're so, so excited! excited. <laughs> oh. Hmm. What's wrong? Is there a problem? <laughs> of course not. I'll go straight home. Huh. What? Why are you canceling on us? I'm not canceling. I'm just postponing. Polly says that it's dangerous to be outside in this temperature. What's so dangerous about the weather? My family goes to the beach when it's hot in the summer all the time. That's right. What? Can't handle a little heat? Oh, yes, I can. I was just worried about the two of you. But you huh? promised! Oh. Liar! Uh. That's right! You uh. promised! Uh, guys, okay, all right, I will take you. Really? Yes, you bet. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Uh. And let's go! Oh, it's really hot. Bobby! What is it? I think your air conditioner is broken. It's too hot in here. Sorry. I'll open the windows up. Oh, that's even hotter. I can't breathe. I want to get out. Yes, Scooby. Oh. Please. Okay. Uh. 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 Come out. Uh. Uh. I don't feel well. Uh. 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 I'm dizzy. Uh -huh. uh. I'm going to throw up. Uh, I have to do something. Wait right here. I'm calling the rescue team. Hopefully they can help. My head hurts. Rescue team here yet? I need to get back to the children. Oh, why am I so sleepy? Oh, oh. Don't worry, we're here to help. But where is Scooby? Scooby left to call you, but never came back for us. Holy, I'll go take care of the children. You and Roy go find Scooby. Okay. Sit here in the shade and drink this water. All better. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> Scooby! Can you hear us? Scooby! Holy? Holy! I'm here! I'm coming! Scooby! Huh? There! Huh? I see Scooby! Hmm. Oh, I feel woozy. And I'm having trouble steering. Oh. Watch out! I can't stop! It's your turn, Roy! Is everyone all right? We're okay, but Scooby is overheated. 
We have to get him into the shade and cool down. Okay, let's do it. Hmm. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I feel better now. Hmm. Oh, what an old-fashioned town. Hi, Camp. Good to see you. I'm Helly of Broomstown Rescue Team. If you need any help, just ask. I'll come flying right away to lend a hand. Out of my way. You're tiresome. Huh? Uh, I'm tiresome? <laughs> Wait. Huh? You're not allowed to scribble there. Oh, a scribble? I guess you don't know me. I am a journalist from the famous magazine Travel is Fun, and this here is my signature. I hope you have a lovely visit. I'm Polly of the Broomstown Rescue Team. Oh, the rescue team again? Oh, it sounds like you've already met one of us. But still, you can't scribble on this nice monument. I said it's not a scribble. This is frustrating. In the future, that scribble, uh, no, I mean that signature, will be the town's attraction. Hmm. Huh? Where are you going? This one might be a troublemaker. What, what, what? No camping allowed. Hello? Huh? Hi, would you be Camp the Writer? Oh, at long last, it's so nice to be recognized. Sure thing, I'm Roy of the Broomstown Rescue Team. Another one? Yet you look a little bit smarter than the others. You should know that I'm going to be camping here tonight. Camp here? That's not going to be possible. This dry weather makes forest fires more likely. Camping just isn't allowed here. What? Well, you are just the same as the hovering pest, nagging police car, and meddling ambulance. And now to top it all off, a terribly stubborn and nasty fire engine. What? Traveling to this place is proving to be dreadful. Because the rescue team's everywhere, ruining everything! Oh, what a horrible town! Oh? I don't see anyone. <laughs> okay, let the camping begin. Stars, romance, dust. Uh huh. <laughs> campfire, campfire, burning bright. Lighten up, you brighten up the autumn night. Sparking up the dark and making it feel all right. Campfire, campfire, shine your light. Oh, huh? what on earth is that smell? Oh, goodness. Oh. oh, no, this isn't what I intended at all. got a fire to put out. We will handle what's left of the fire. Let's do this. Yeah. Oh, 
one slightly charred ukulele. I'm glad that you didn't get charred as well. We're, We're happy, happy you're safe. safe. We're under a hurricane warning for the next several hours here in Broomstown, guys. Now, the storm could be quite large, so all of us have to prepare just in case it does come. Don't you worry, Jin. We'll check every single part of Broomstown and make sure that it's prepared for the worst. <laughs> So we should split up to cover more ground, since this is an emergency. Roy, listen. Check the shoreline and the harbor. Mm-hmm. Amber, all the suburbs are yours. All right. And I'll handle the center of town. And me? I think you should stay here at headquarters. On a day like this, flying is just too dangerous. You don't have to worry. An old hurricane isn't going to keep me down, Helly. Don't you remember the last storm? How your propeller got all messed up? The wind is several uh, times worse outside now than it was then. Yeah, yeah Helly. Listen, listen to Jin because, because she's, she's right. right. I'm not just sitting around while my town has a hurricane. I'm going to prove to you that I'm strong enough to do my job. Helly! 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 It's Helly! Posty! Posty! Oh, Helly! Uh, uh, what happened? Uh, I was on my way back from a delivery and suddenly the bridge was just gone. It's too dangerous to try crossing here. We have to find shelter. Let's try to get to the mountain cabin. All right. Uh, uh, Posty, what's wrong? I just can't go anymore. No, you have to go inside. If you stay out here, the hurricane will blow you away. I can't. I'm out of power. Ow. Uh. Posty, wake up! Ah! Oh no, I'll have to get an emergency charger. Hang on, Posty! I'll be back! Is he all right? He needs an emergency charge. Holy, Amber and I will handle this. You go on and look for Helly. Sure, you get him inside then. Don't, Don't worry. worry. Uh, uh, gotta get out. Uh, huh? My propeller's broken? Jin! Jin! Hey guys, please answer. <laughs> I can't get through. Helly! Holly? Helly, hold on! I'll be right there! Hmm. Now I'm safe because Polly came! <laughs> you alright? Yes, but I'm not able to fly! You'll be fine. Let's get you out of here. I'll try, but can you really lift us both? You bet. Just believe in me. Nice. Let's hurry. The water is rapidly rising. Grab on. Okay. Going up. Uh, uh, is something wrong? Uh, uh, Polly, you all right? I'm fine. Trying again. Uh, uh, Ah! Holly! Uh, Helly, are you all right? I'm just fine. Are you okay? I'm great. Let's try this one more time. Huh? Uh. Holly! Just a bit more. 
Uh, would you like a hand? Hi, Roy. Really nice timing, friend. Hosty, you guys! I'm glad you're all okay! Yeah! yeah. Hey, there's a Scooby rumor that's spreading all over town! Rumor? Yeah! They say in town that Scooby goes out at night and drives everywhere all covered in mud! Now huh? why would a grown school bus want to do something strange like that? <laughs> Scooby, your little secret will be revealed tonight. How come nothing's happening? Huh? There he goes! Huh? Thornbush Road? Wait a minute! Scooby said his nightmares were about these exact same things. In my nightmare, I'm driving across Owl Valley Bridge and it's just so dangerous that I'm on a road completely surrounded by thorns. Then I'm driving headlong into the swamp. That means the swamp's next. Scooby! Uh, ow! Huh, Scooby! Stop! Oh, Scooby! Scooby! Please stop! Oh, come on! Are you sleeping? Rescue Scooby before he wakes up! Amber, we need to pull him together, so give us a three count. Oh, right! Helly, how about a little light? Sure thing! Everybody ready? Yes! yes. All right, three count, then pull. One, two, three! Uh, pull! Uh, pull! Almost! Let's uh, pull! Hey! Calm down, Scooby! Just stay calm! Scooby, wake up! It's not a nightmare! What? I'm not having a nightmare? Scooby! Uh -huh. Amber? It's real! We're trying to pull you out of the swamp! Oh, I don't understand. I was sure that I was just dreaming. Scooby, we're going to get you out of there, all right? Just hold on a little longer. Thanks. Uh, yeah, I'll try. Uh, Roy, let's try again. Ready? Pull! Right! Uh, uh. <laughs> what? Sleepwalking? But what is sleepwalking? Sleepwalking is when someone walks around when they're actually asleep. It can happen because someone is experiencing extra stress or isn't getting enough rest. Ah, oh, my nightmares. I wasn't just dreaming, it was all actually happening. That's where all of those mysterious scratches came from. Then you weren't actually out late playing every night. You were sleepwalking instead. Do you have any idea when this might have started? I guess it was hmm. just about a week ago. <gasps> that morning I woke up late because the alarm didn't go off. The children were about to be late to school because of me. I was rushing to the bus stop, swerving and yelling. Oh. After the accident, 
I started worrying about all kinds of stuff. If the alarm had gone off properly, I wouldn't have been late, and if I hadn't been late, I wouldn't have gotten into an accident. That's when I started having nightmares. What's going to become of me if I keep sleepwalking? I'll sink into the swamp, or even worse, I might be late. Don't worry. Sleepwalking is curable. Uh, you're sure? I am. Ball game, ball game, <sighs> ball game, ball game, ball game. Okay, just go and get the ball. The crew is all waiting for us. <laughs> Woohoo! Ball game, ball game, ball game. <sighs> I wish I could just take him somewhere far away and leave him. Leave him? There we go. That's a fabulous idea. Okay, I huh? got it. Are we ready to play? <laughs> Bruni, so do you want to mm -hmm. learn this new game that I know? Yeah! Well, then, you need to find a ladder. You've never played a game this fun in your entire life. A ladder? Where am I supposed to find one? Look over there, behind huh? Mr. Builder's house. You can handle it on your own. I mean, you're strong enough, right? Yes! I'm totally strong! Woohoo! A ladder! A ladder! A ladder! A ladder! A ladder! Bye, a Bruni. Ladder. I'm sorry. I just can't do this today. <laughs> Hello? Bruner? Where are you? Oh, there's that fun ride. Whoa, going up. This is great. <laughs> Look how high. <laughs> Hey. What's up, Bruner? You keep missing it. Is everything all right? <laughs> yeah, sorry. I'll throw it again. I have to say, this is more fun without your cousin. Yeah. No, I hope that Bruni's okay. Bruner, where are you? Yeah. <laughs> I can't take it anymore. You guys huh? go ahead. I have to get going. <laughs> you can play without me. Bruner? Uh, he's acting really weird. Yeah. I hope nothing bad happened to him while I was gone. I never should have left him alone. Bruner! <laughs> now I'm even hearing his voice! Bruner! Huh? Help! Bruni! Let's do this. <laughs> Bruni? Holy! Are you all right? Yes. We're all so proud of you for being brave. But let's get you out of here. Okay. Huh? That's causing this. We should hurry and get to the roof. Oh. Roy, pull us up. Right. Oh. <laughs> Rooney, nothing's going to happen to you. You'll be fine. Ah. <laughs> Come on. Uh. Ah. What's going on? We're all right. Great. Hold on. I'll pull you up. Thanks. Rooney, hold tight. Mm -hmm. We're going up. Okay. Oh. Uh -huh. 
<sighs> this never would have happened if I hadn't left him all by himself. <laughs> Don't worry, Bruner. Uh, Bruni's gonna be all right. Bruner, uh, over here! What? Bruni! Hi! <laughs> oh. It's all my fault. I'm so sorry, Bruni. <laughs>